Hey guys, thanks to some great developers over at XDA, I've managed to get a Nougat ROM running on my Galaxy Tab 3. This is Lineage OS, basically a rebranded Cyanogen mod ROM. Here you can see more info about the firmware itself. If you would also like to give it a go, you're going to need a couple of things. As you would expect, your tablet has to be rooted and you need to have a custom recovery installed. Specifically, you need TWRP version 3.0.2-5. After that, you'll need a couple of zip files transferred onto your tablet. This video was shot on 14th of January 2017 and the ROM and GApps files weren't enough. You needed an additional boot zip file to flash right after the first two. I'll have links to download pages for everything you need down in the video description. Ok, let's get on to the installation itself. We'll perform a clean flash. First, reboot to recovery. The usual way to get to recovery is by turning the tablet off and then holding home, volume up and power buttons at the same time. When you boot to TWRP recovery, once again make sure you're running the version number 3.0.2-5. Then you go on with the first step, which is to wipe data from the device. Select Advanced Wipe and check Dalvik slash Art Cache, System, Cache and Data. Swipe and let the wiping begin, it should take about a minute. Ok, we now need to install new firmware, so select the Lineage OS zip file. You can select more files at once, so add gapps to the queue and do the same with the boot zip file. We have now added everything we need to flash, so we can confirm with a swipe. Flashing of the firmware file should take less than a minute, flashing of gapps a bit longer around 7 minutes and flashing of the boot image should be over in a flash. Now you're ready to reboot. First boot will take a while, again around 7 minutes. And here we are. You can still see some leftover Cyanogen mod branding. Ok, let's quickly set up the tablet for use. Immediately you can see some new features, we've now got a choice of two launchers. I'll focus on Pixel Launcher. Yeah, you can see the signature Pixel Launcher app drawer. Let's go on further. Here's the Nougat Quick Toggle. Settings menu is also redesigned, offering more information at first glance. You can see details about every tile. Let's activate developer options. Here's the new menu entry. We'll enable root access. I also like to have the advanced reboot menu. Ok, you don't need to read my email. So let's see what's working. Chrome.
working okay. Let's check the camera. Okay, it's even changing orientation. How about video recording? Let's see what we've captured. Oh, it's looping. Okay, enough of that. So I see stuff seems to be working, I'll have to test it with a SIM card, but for now that's it. As always, thanks for watching and until the next video, goodbye.